focus. Yeah. Well, good morning, guys. Running a little bit behind this morning, but we are headed to Oklahoma today to do some fishing out of heated docks. Well, good morning, good morning, guys. We finally made it out here to Oklahoma, Grand Lake. We're at Lee's Resort. We're about to head down to a heated dock. I'm pretty excited about this. I've only done this one other time before. The bite wasn't that great when we came out here last time, but it was definitely a way for me to kind of get used to this heated dock fishing. We've got some live bait today. I'm told live bait really ain't the way to go this time of year, but we just wanted to cover all our bases. We got live bait, we've got hair jigs, we've got plastics. Hoping to be able to catch some slabs, put some fish in the basket, take some meat home to that freezer. So let's get after it, guys. Double fist in it. Yeah. I think I need to reposition that minnow. I'm not liking it being all around that rope. Put it over here on this far side. Oh, hooked up. There he is. What a decent fish. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Blake with the first fish. Oh yeah, well, he will measure for sure. But it looks like the first one in the basket. Yeah. She go ten. Eleven. Eleven. Very nice. First one in the basket. Uh, we're trying to get it there, but boy, it's hard. Do what? It wouldn't be too bad for one to win. Yeah. Yeah, it definitely gets down to your bones. Yeah. All right. Nice. One in the basket. Number one. Killing it. Very good. Putting them in the basket today, man. Another one on that perp. Yep. Yeah. 
Ten and a half. I'll keep an eye on the rods. If I catch one on your rod, it still counts toward me. <laughs> I'm like flirting with that brush. Look at him. Look at him. That was my fish. It's a little one. But man, you're, I mean, you're wrecking them. Very nice. Ooh, that one's gonna be a burner. I don't know if that's quite. What color is that one on? Purple. Oh, by golly. I can't even remember now. Finally, guys, first fish, beautiful white crappie. Got it on the Strike King split tail or tri tail. He's going to be close. We're going to see what we can do. All right. Let's go get this one in the basket because he is going to get a pot of grease dirty, that's for sure. fish basket. Let's toss him in there with his buddies. Looks like we got four, four in the basket. All right, midday update guys. Got a few in the basket, I think like five. Uh, me and Blake's caught most of them. I don't, I don't think Derek has even caught a crappie. I think he caught a white bass and a bass. And then Bryce has caught one little baby crappie. But right now it is lunchtime. We're going to kind of convene for a little lunch break. And hopefully, I don't know if we're going to hit this same spot like I said when we get done with lunch or if we're going to go to a different spot. But we still got the afternoon. Let's hope that bite picks up.
Alright guys, so we're going to go ahead and wrap up the day. Came back for this afternoon bite, not really much going on. We caught a couple of small fish, uh, nothing to throw in the keeper basket. I've got the five keepers that I'm going to be taking home and throwing in some grease for me and the wife. Uh, no real specific pattern. We didn't get any hits on the live bait today. A uh, couple on the hair jigs, couple on plastics, and really the colors varied as well. We we used blacks and purples, and then even got a couple hits on like red and chartreuse. So it's really just this wintertime pattern, finicky, finicky fish that are just hard to catch. But anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Until next time, stay safe, stay outdoors.